And each time we find one, we put it in our... But I want that hamburger and that hot dog right. today. And when we find our last clue... Today. To I want to fart all night. Uh, where do we go? What's I want to fart all night, Just actually. Go off of baked beans and devil eggs. We take them. I know y'all hear that AC blowing. I'm not even being rude. Like, do you want to see the next clip of me in the hospital? With ice packs all over me from heat exhaustion? Well, then I'm not being rude. I'm, I'm just taking care of my health. I'm protecting my health right now. You know, when you're a one-man band, they don't look bad at all. They'll do for a screw. Leg out. I've been up for about ooh, maybe a little bit over an hour now. Um, getting ready to head downstairs and get Baby Brooks his breakfast. I thought I was about to make some oatmeal for Baby Brooks. Is what I thought I was about to do. Oh, I am. Okay, I am. <clears throat> yeah, about to make some oatmeal, some instant oatmeal for Baby Brooks. And um, I don't know what I'm going to eat for myself. I'll probably just wait because I need to do, um, I need to get my son out of the way. He said he got stuff to do today. Um, I'll have to look at, on my little schedule thing and see what all I had planned on getting done today. But I know... I need to go on and get my son out of the way first. He wants to get his hair braided and he wants he needs to get another key because he said he dropped his key in the car vent of somebody's car and now he can't get it out. And he has been knocking and ringing the doorbell and doing all types of crazy stuff to get in the house. So out that's my toe. Uh oh. Say good morning. Good morning. Say good morning, snot nose. All right. He ain't messing with y'all. But anyway, let let us get the day started and um you know, y'all know how it go. All right, mommy gonna make you some oatmeal. Basically. 
basically I'm not fully I'm not even evicted yet it's just they're trying to collect a debt that doesn't exist they have to prove the debt and what it is and where it comes from that's where we're at right now but at this moment we don't care what debt they come up with where it comes from we're getting about it here because But yeah, I don't know if y'all um, was paying any attention to the way that I was blow drying his hair. But what I did was, um, I had his hair sectioned in six different blocks. And, uh, and I just blow dry each section one at a time. And I made it a point to say that because I can't tell y'all how many hair salons. I go to the hair salon just to get my hair shampooed. If you... Pay any attention to my vlogs. I tell y'all all the time. I hate shampooing my own hair. I don't like shampooing my hair. I don't want. I don't want to shampoo hair in my house. I don't know if that comes from fourteen the fourteen years that I was a hairstylist or what, but I just don't want to shampoo hair in my house. So I pay. I don't give a dang how much it costs. I will pay to go get my hair shampooed. And I've had people that can shampoo my hair, clean it, uh, condition it, moisturize it, and do all that part really good. But when they get ready to blow dry my hair, like they just leave it out in a fro, take the blow dryer, and just start going. I, first of all, I'm tender headed, but even if I wasn't, do you know how much hair you're ripping out of the scalp by doing it that way? That is crazy to me. That is so many licensed stylists out here that cannot even do a simple shampoo and blow dry. Like what cosmo what cosmetology school did y'all go to? Yay! Oh <laughs> Nathan, you missed from you. So with that being the case, I just feel like you need to do better. But she just I don't know. She might be a little slow. Shit, I don't know. But you can't call everybody slow. So that's that. I didn't want to do his hair, but he asked me um, probably over a week ago if I could do his hair so that. Um, he said he's getting like a. Him and his friends are getting like an Airbnb today from somebody mama coming to cook chicken and ribs and some other stuff out on the grill <sighs> listen long as these kids is being safe and not doing nothing crazy because y'all so much stuff just goes on in this world today that is crazy somebody you're new here make sure you're no. turning on the notifications because I got important stuff over here. here I got lucky charms the last time you came over here you knocked them over and I almost lost them I almost lost my lucky charms yes messing with you Anyway, y'all, Lathan is not going to let me be great right now. Um, I'm about to go. I, I really am in the ta I, I, I'm in the mood for noodles. I want to go downstairs and cook me some noodles, but um, I be doing a lot to my noodles. So, I don't think the ingredients that I need are down there. 
So me and Lathan just about to go get something to eat and I'll be back to start on my hair. Seems like I push against the clouds. They just keep locking down the sun. Every time I drink this, I feel like I'm torturing myself. But one thing I know is. You can't beat results. You can't beat results. And like I told y'all when I did my weigh-in at the end of June, I know at least 30% of the weight that I lost was contributed to this little bottle. Just one of these a day. So, and it use it. I mean, I said it usually. It literally gives you all the ingredients right here. Like the only thing that's in the bottle. Oh, is that it right there? Turmeric, ginger, and oil of oregano. That's the only three things in the bottle. Y'all, it doesn't, it's not good. I always have to brush my teeth and my tongue really well after I take it. When I take it at work, because a lot of times I take it at work once I already get to my desk. So, in those instances, I either follow it up with a um like a smoothie or um something that can kind of coat my tongue until i can brush my teeth on my break like this watching blues clues i'm watching the trey king show so it's just loud in here right now um now i got my mind right so that i can get up and go get something to eat but what i'm gonna do is I'm just going to um, go to the grocery store and get what I want. Because I was telling y'all I wanted some noodles. But at a couple of hours ago, I didn't feel like going inside the grocery store. But now I can, um, now I have the energy to get out and go in the grocery store. And my mom is home now. So, because, um, you know, he is, he's staying home this weekend while me and Papa Go live our best okay. life. Now, Thank you, Jesus. Handy dandy. No, um, no. So, right. I need to make sure that he got everything he need. That's what I can do. Let me go get a checklist real quick from my mom to see yeah, what all she's going to need. I sure am. Yay. Whoa. Yay. Yay. Yeah, yay. Like that. You know, I can tell I'm really gonna need your to see what all she's gonna need me to get. I mean, she's gonna wanna have to um to keep her grandson everything that I wanna put in my noodles. And then when we get back home, we're gonna make some devil eggs because and I want a hamburger, a hot dog, baked beans and potato salad on my plate. That's what I'm praying is on my plate. But I also want to make me my own yeah, devil yeah, eggs yeah. to go with that. Three socks? Yes, it is. It's crazy. Mm. Three socks. Yes, it is. Each time we find one, we put it in our... But I want that hamburger and that hot dog right. today. When we find our last clue... Today. To I want to fart all night. Uh, where do we go? What's I want to fart all night, Just actually. I for baked beans and devil eggs. We take a bath. And that's right? okay. That's okay. Unless we get really good. Um, so, where do we go after we find all this so let me get up let me get my butt up that was motivation that was motivation right there y'all see i'm still looking crazy am i going in walmart looking like this absolutely absolutely so um yeah let go let go like we're over a little bit
me tell y'all something right now. We're not about to be in Walmart no longer than approximately 10 minutes, if I can help it, because when I tell you it's hot in here, it's friggin' hot. Now, what y'all know about this brand right here? Because I don't know nothing about it. I guess I'm going to try this one. We'll see what she's giving. She is uh, $12.44, so we'll see what she's talking about. Or two. Now this is the detergent that I use. I like the Arm & Hammer um, Sensitive Skin. They also have the free, is it free? Yeah, they also have the free and clear in scents too and they smell really good. I will say that since this location did a remodel, it is um, a lot more organized. I can say that. Okay. I ain't wanna step in front of your camera. Oh no, you good. she talking to when she said please take one because I definitely took four and kept it pumping but whatever I have used the seasoning pack out of here before, so I'ma just do that. I really wanted the, um, how you say this brand? Marchand. I really wanted the Marchand um, beef pack, but it is not available to me. I really didn't want this brand, but hold on. There we go. I ended up with the Velastic Sweet Relish and this get right this is the brand that i wanted the mount olive that's the deal really i'll show y'all um how to make it when we get to the crib out
how I'm feel. What y'all waiting on? Get y'all butt in this car. It's hot out here. Ooh. I know y'all hear that AC blowing. I'm not even being rude. Like, do you want to see the next clip of me in the hospital? With ice packs all over me from heat exhaustion? Well, then I'm not being rude. I'm, I'm just taking care of my health. I'm protecting my health right now. Y'all, it is friggin' hot. The humidity in Georgia is disrespectful. It's disrespectful because the temperature actually only says 86. I can handle 86 degree weather. Me and the sun don't have the best relationship. So that's, I mean, that's one thing, but I can handle 86 degree weather, but the humidity that's coming along with it is hitting like 96 and I cannot take. I cannot take. My lips are ashy. I'm sweating profusely. My hair looks crazy. But y'all, even if I would have went in there, glammed up, or just looking decent, you know what I mean? When people see a camera, it just does something to them. You can just tell, like, when certain people, like, get that look or they start doing all this unnecessarily unnecessary mumbling under their breath like it's like relax like this is <laughs> this is not your 15 minutes of fame i'm not stalking you the cartel is not coming to get you like this is about me bro relax but yeah um but anyway, I said all of this to say that I still ain't got no onions. I said all of that to say that I still don't have onions after all of that. And I know I've told y'all that I needed some onions at least 17 times. Still don't have onions. So love that for me. Um, I'm not going back in. The heat has definitely said, sit down. And I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to sit down. Uh, let's go home and make double eggs.
tell y'all something this plate probably looks from a one out of ten the plate is probably looking like a four but it's slapping like a 12 okay this food has lots of african-american flavor off up in here mm. don't ever think 
that's not giving what it's supposed to give. It's not coming across right on the camera. But, y'all, this is what I have waited on all day. The only thing I've had in my mouth today was I took my ginger, turmeric, and oil of oregano shot. I had a protein bar. And I ate two devil eggs before this plate got here. Now, now I'm finna be fat. And I'm not ashamed. I was screaming from the rooftops. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Happy holiday to me. Now there was air. If y'all don't have an eight ship, it's like a super spicy Dorito with a slight hint of lime on the end. Slap. Slap. And it hoops. I'm going to be disrespectful. And then I'm going to probably need me a Celsius to um, keep my eyes open to finish my hair. But we'll see. Um, right about now, it's all about the food. My split ends look a fool, but I already don't want to do my hair as is, so tonight ain't the night that I'm pulling out the shears and um, trimming my ends. It just ain't. I'm sorry. These things just going to have to continue to stay dead to the bed, but I'll get it all done tonight. Y'all, the firecrackers are going to huff and puff and blow my house down. Let me go on and get finished. It ain't like I'm going to be able to go to bed with them out here having a whole, uh, py what it's called? I was going to say Pyrex. Y'all know what I'm trying to say. I, 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 you know what? I'm probably going to tell y'all goodnight. I'm probably about to tell y'all goodnight because... The baby gonna be waking up in a minute. My baby daddy is gonna be walking through the door in a minute. And I'm already this far from being irritated between the fireworks and wait until this time of night to start braiding my hair. So I don't wanna take it out on you because you don't deserve that. So y'all have a great night. But
Okay, y'all, this um spectral hair is just like I suspected. It's, it's rough. Spectral is rough. And if anybody is saying to themselves, does she know that that hair is purple and all the rest of her hair is black and whatever color her natural hair is? Yes. I am full aware that I just put one purple braid in my head. Why, you ask? Because I've had every other color up under the sun and i've never had this particular combination so that was one reason and another reason is the pisces in me will not let me just be regular degular and just do a full head of black hair like that would be too much like cookie cutter following the trend doing what's right like uh-uh that's not me that's not me at all so the purple with the white on the tip is just pretty much my stamp um it's just me putting my own little twist on the hairdo that's it that's all this one purple braid probably won't match anything that I have on over the weekend but hey I'm still going to be excited about my one little purple braid I don't even feel like purple actually really looks good on my skin um, braid wise the color that looks the prettiest on my skin is of course my favorite color green um, but hey if you know me then you know I'm going to make a look do what it do regardless regardless the time now is 1.34am and I'm finally done with the day I have wrapped up the day I think I told y'all I wasn't even going to come back I was just going to show y'all my hair in the morning but um, I figured hey why not give y'all receipts and proof that I braided my own hair no help no assistance so um yeah I just wanted to come and put the last braid in with y'all I'm getting ready to call it a night work calls in the morning duty calls um two more days of work and then of course I'm not gonna play with my edges or do none of that until I probably won't even do my edges to go to work tomorrow I probably won't um, put no more product on my hair until um, Friday when we get to the hotel. I'll spruce myself up. But um, as far as these braids go, now all I have to do is dip them in some hot water to seal them up 
make them soft so they're not so stiff looking and yeah that's gonna be the look for the vacation vlog so I feel like I can't I feel like I can't close my mouth. My lash is hanging. <laughs> Don't pay my edges no mind. Those will get done at some point. But yeah, y'all. You know, when you're a one man band, they don't look bad at all. They'll do for a screw. Good night. <laughs>